breaking news right now. This out of Pinellas County. A Seminole homeowner is in the hospital tonight after a violent scuffle with an intruder. News Channel 8's Jamel Lene joins us now live at the scene on Williams Boulevard. And Jamel, we're learning new information. That story has changed about how the homeowner got shot, correct? It has, Stacy. We just got an update from the Pinellas County Sheriff's Office. They are saying that after speaking with the homeowner, that the homeowner realized that the suspect shot him. So the deputies are now telling us that this homeowner was shot by the suspect. That shooting happening right here at this home on Williams Boulevard in Seminole. So let's go to some video that we shot earlier today. The Sheriff's Office deputies, they tell us that the intruder forced his way through the back door just before 1230. Uh, detectives say that the homeowner Carl Ott was startled and got his weapon. Now, the suspect and the homeowner, they got into an altercation and the gun went off. Now, investigators say when they arrived on the scene, Ott, he mistakenly told the deputies that he accidentally shot himself with his own handgun while confronting the, the suspect at his house. Through the course of this investigation, detectives learn that Ott was actually shot by the suspect. At that time, the homeowner, 66-year-old, Carl Edward Ott uh, was in his bed asleep when he heard the noise and at that time he got up grabbed his handgun to confront these uh, suspects. Now, again, he was shot in the forearm. He's at the hospital. He's expected to be okay, but the suspect, he got away. He is still on the loose at this time. It's not clear if he ran away from the scene or if he got into a vehicle, and they don't have a pretty clear description about what this guy actually looks like. So right now they are asking residents to stay vigilant and stay on the lookout. All right, Jamel Lene, live in Seminole for us. Thank you.